Hello there, everybody. Hello. So remember, maybe some of you may remember this, but a long time ago, we said that if this channel ever wasn't our job, we would still make videos. Well, this is that video. More or less, we are pretty much out of the YouTube race. Now, that's not to say we won't make videos anymore. In fact, we have a personal goal to make a YouTube video every week, but that's for us. What we're basically done with is making videos for the YouTube algorithm. That has pretty much become the job of YouTube, and the original spirit of us making videos and creating things online in general has always been to share our perspective, share something we made, mm -hmm. just put ourselves out there. So before we get into this video, I do want to mention that if you do want to support any of our future endeavors, um, we do have a Patreon, uh, joltoy.com slash Patreon, and our Twitter has more info on some other hidden hmm. Patreons, wink wink, wink. wink. Um, if you want to check those out. It's frustrating because the past couple of months, the comment section has probably been the best we've ever had it. People have, were engaging like very relative to what we were doing. People were direct with their responses. People were being goofy. It was fun. Yeah. But the YouTube algorithm was wagging its little finger at us. YouTube like, no, said, no, no, no. fuck fun. And uh, essentially, <laughs> it, it puts us in this rock and hard place where the only way we can subsidize the cost is just either shill out to advertising agencies or constantly promote merch, which it's it's fun we enjoy doing the merch we enjoy all of that but it, it's a numbers game after a while yeah and we just can't compete with the numbers game we just want to make videos again mm -hmm. we want to make make let's plays and we don't really want the motives to be profit i, I don't know about emmy so much cuz she still plays video games but for me, I don't play video games for the same reason anymore. I play video games for work, and that's about it. Anything for me is rare. Before we did Let's Plays, at least re until just recently, it felt like this is like a past couple of years this has really been hitting me, but it just, I don't know, I fell out of my habit of playing video games for myself. I began forming these habits to play games for the channel, which is, it's fine. I, I like video games, but I, I miss my video game time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like my time. I don't really get to play video games for me anymore. So that's the kind of stuff we really want to be putting on the channel. Things that we decide what we want to put on the channel. And if you've noticed, we haven't really um, done much with this video. That's because this is all we really want to do. Just talk, maybe put some footage up and just put it out there and ramble. And it's this constant grasp for engagement that we just can't, I don't know, I can't do it anymore. I, I don't enjoy any of the things that I started this channel to celebrate. I don't enjoy it anymore. So I, I just don't see the point of pursuing the career of being a YouTuber if I could do this as a hobby, or at least somewhat professionally, because we still have our monetization. We'll still, you know, make money off of videos. But the it would motive be nice to not have to worry about YouTube, you know, pulling a fucky wucky. Yeah, and your rent being dictated not only by the the mystery of YouTube, which this has nothing to do with the current YouTube problems. Just like every other issue, it's just like dramatic until it's not. If you go back in history, all YouTube drama happened this way, so this is going to be the same. Um, but this has nothing to do with that. This is just September, I think, was the last month our channel profited to the point where we could obtain a livable wage. And October, we took a hands-off approach just to see what would happen if the channel would dip and it sure thing it dipped harsher than we've ever seen it before yeah. youtube sniped one of our viral videos quite literally killing the channel and that's that's it that's the story that's how just like a snipe from the woods that's all it took to take us down 
Good job, YouTube. Thanks.、Um, I do think that it may have had something to do with the current YouTube problems, but who cares at this point? I just want to start making videos for me and Emmy. Our videos. The videos that portray us, the way we want to be portrayed, not the way the algorithm wants us to portray ourselves. So we can say whatever the fuck we want. This isn't for kids. Our channel has never been for kids. And anyone who thinks our channel has been for kids, I don't know what to say. I mean, how many videos can we say? Hi, if you're a baby, please stop watching this. <laughs> yeah, we just, we, we like cutesy art styles that we draw. In that way, and we like seeing art in that way, so it's just no surprise that that's the style we choose. But anyway, that's a, another video.、Um, I don't know, there's just a lot on my mind lately considering the whole like YouTube as a job thing.、Yeah. I feel like when you're this far in, if you're not established in a way that doesn't stress you out, it's kind of pointless. It feels like you're always rolling the ball uphill. And I just can't do that anymore. This, this job is not that interesting to me. And when I, when I say that, this job, I mean the YouTube side, like figuring out what algorithm, like what the algorithm likes, what the algorithm doesn't like.、Mm. How about we just entertain our viewers and we come back every Wednesday at 12? <laughs> I think that that would just work better. And we don't promise a boatload of content. So the algorithm is like, ooh, good job. Now do that again tomorrow. And the next day. And the next day. And the next month. And the next year. It, it, this like constant judgment of yourself. Like you're always measuring yourself to the algorithm. Like, ooh, how does the algorithm think I look today? You know, you stand up tall and you smile with your cheeky smile, you dumb little. <laughs> Bow tie and the algorithm's like, you look stupid. Who the fuck wears that doll? Exactly. The algorithm was like, you look stupid. Get out of here. And I don't know. I can't, I can't put a song and dance on every day and expect like my mental health to stay stable. I don't know. It's like this need to be relevant kind of becomes your personality. When you do it on a daily basis. And I just can't, my livelihood can't be dependent on how interesting I am. Sometimes I'm not that interesting, and I'm not the most interesting person. <laughs> I'm really not. So when my self, like literally, the what I am marketable, like what my market value is, is dependent on whether or not I'm interesting. And I mean, I, I do interesting things sometimes. Like, you, look, I made an animation, or, ooh, look, I, I made a drawing. Like, I guess that's remotely interesting, but that, that, that's not like career defining. And I don't know. I miss, I miss that being my reason. Like, oh, it's not career defining. So, who cares if I make a dumb animation? Who cares if my writing flops? Who cares if my. Videos just get dislike bombed because they're dumb. I don't know. I used to have a hard shell for that. But YouTube kind of softened me up because it was, it like replaced the foundation for my self worth and then it started to rot. So, what you're saying is you went soft? No, I say, I, I mean, technically, I mean, shut up. What's wrong with being soft? Boys That's not can what cry. I'm talking about, but okay. <laughs> anyway, I want to do more of that. This, Emmy. Yeah. More bouncing off of each other and just being ourselves off the cuff. I don't know. I know this is probably not the video you're expecting us to return with. Basically, we're fired. But. I guess. I mean, I'm firing myself. Fuck it. I'm fired. You're done. Clear your desk. Okay. It's time to move on. I cleared it. Anyway, for a personal challenge of ours, like I mentioned earlier in the video, I want to make a YouTube video every week. Every week. I don't care what it's about. I don't care what genre we stick to. And I hope you guys don't really care either because 
Uh, we're going whatever direction <laughs> life takes us now. This channel is now going to have mostly like a personal spin to it. And if we want to sprinkle an extra content here and there, we might. I don't know. No promises. We're not promising anything anymore. The weekly videos are a personal challenge, and we do intend to meet that goal. Because, honestly, I could use the structure in my life. I could use a little more uh, discipline oh, well, in that way. So, and, you know, the little extra money would be nice, not gonna lie, but the career of this, the, the, the way that this upholds my livelihood the money that I use to survive I'm done I can't take the stress anymore yeah. I, we want something stable I just want to make YouTube videos without worrying about the world yeah. burning like if we get cancelled and it's not our you like YouTube isn't our job it doesn't really matter does it <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so we can just do whatever. No, oh, oh, not that implies anything. What do you mean? Knowing, knowing Twitter, thinking, oh, what does that imply? It doesn't fucking imply anything. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, that's that. We, um, I don't know. Do non YouTubers do outros? Shut up. We'll see you Wednesday at noon next week. See you then.